Hi everyone, today I'll show you how to use the Natu making machine. So, I just plug it in already. The display is not showing uh, well, it's because uh, of the frequency between the camera and the LCD. But in real life, it's fine, it just displays fine and constant. So, first thing you need to do is that you need to remove this stack. Alright, so once that's done, you need to fill up the device with five cups of this 80 ml so 80 times 5 is 400 so you're going to fill this up with 400 ml of water Right. Once it's done, we need to fill these containers, the ceramic containers, two thirds full with beans. Right, so once that's done, for every every container like this, we need to fill it up with two cups of water. So I'm gonna use filtered water. So just now the amount of beans was 500 grams so I guess each time this machine can do 500 grams or slightly more because I noticed that some of them are not exactly two thirds so let's see so all right so now all the containers are filled with water ready and we're gonna turn this on I'm gonna show you the interface I'm gonna re-angle the camera right now Alright, so now we're gonna select the modes. We're gonna need to cover the device with this cover. Cover the beans with the cover. And then we're gonna select the mode. So we need to select this top left uh, bottle, which means soaking the beans. But I think it's not gonna be just a normal soak because it has temperature control. It's a temperature control, so that's why it only takes three hours. So once you selected Tauto, automatically it will give you a 3 hour timer so confirm and the process will begin in 10 seconds alright so as time passes you can see that there are vapors so that means it's a heated soaking process it's, it feels like slightly warm so it's not exactly hot so it's a mild heating process involved in the soaking of the beans So when it's done, it will beep like this manner. You can see that it's ready now. Alright, so now we're gonna remove the cow. Take out the beans. So I can feel that it's a bit warm. So indeed, it's a, a warm soaking process. I'm gonna use this filtration device. I'm gonna filter out the water and then proceed with steaming the beans so you can see that the cover fits on top so just uh, gonna tip it over and the liquid will go out yeah. so you can see that there's not much liquid actually because most of it has been absorbed by the beans you can see that the size is pretty big
think in the future I'll put not so many beans, I'll put less. Uh. Maybe it's like kind of overflowing. Okay, so once I have uh, removed the excess water, I'm going to steam the beans right now. Alright, so now I'm going to start the steaming process. I'm going to cover this first. Alright, then we're going to choose the option. The second, and just, so this option is steaming the beans. So to control, to select that, I press. So now it's just steaming. I'm gonna steam it longer. The default is 1.5, one and a half hours. I'm gonna increase it to longer. So Let's make it two hours. Yeah. So just leave it, then you will just start by itself for two hours. Yeah. Once it beeps, it means that it auto activated. So the steaming process begins now. You can see the steam coming out. So there's a, here, there's a sound. So we can hear the sound that comes from the machine. Alright, so now that it's done steaming, I'm going to sterilize my spoon with hot water. Then use it to put in the, the starter to get it started fermenting. So, there's hot water over here. Sterilize it right now. Alright. So, I'm going to use this to put a starter. So, before I lift this up, I'm going to open the starter first. Okay, so, this is how the starter looks like. Come in little packets. I'm going to lift this up right now. I'm going to use this sterilized spoon. Um, I think there's too, many, too much beans, so I'm going to remove some of them before I put the starter. So now I'm going to insert the starter. I think this time I made too much... Uh, I put in too much of the beans, so in the future I will use probably just 250 grams or 300 grams like that. So yeah, this is a starter. I'm gonna distribute it into each of the...
put it in. I'm gonna cover it up and then activate the fermentation mode for the machine. So this is the cover. So once you put in, you need to open up so that you can breathe. So this is how to activate it for fermentation mode. So you need to select the stop right. So the default is 16 hours, but after thinking about it, I mean the although the manual says to ferment it for 16 hours, I decided to ferment it longer. So I'm gonna select I'm gonna ferment it for 24 hours instead. Alright, so it's done now. Now it's about uh, I think more than 24 hours already. So I'm gonna open it. I'm gonna give you a better view. Smell the natto smell now. You can see it's a success. There you go. If you would like to buy this machine, you can let me know. I can sell it to you. And if you find it really helpful, please like, subscribe, and share. Thank you so much, everyone, for joining. Bye. As you guys next time. Bye. God bless. After emptying all the containers here into the 
this glass container that I have you can see like just how the natto looks like now